everybody and welcome back to another one word create a pet challenge it is a challenge where we have 10 minutes to create a pet that embodies a specific word and because we did just have thanksgiving we thought that turkey would be a great word for this week's create a pet challenge and oh boy you guys i struggled hardcore with creating a dog that looks like a turkey i mean it ended up looking i think it ended up looking pretty good but in the beginning, I was struggling so hardcore with this. Uh, I think my where I went wrong was I was trying to make it look like a realistic turkey. And I'm like, I just, I don't know how to make a dog look like a realistic turkey. As you can see here, I'm starting to struggle trying to give this Australian Shepherd tail feathers. And it just, it, it, it just wasn't working for me. This was just not the way to go. I was like, maybe if I space the feathers out more. No, no, just no. Do not try to put... <laughs> tail feathers on a dog it just it just won't work out for you and so i ended up actually like halfway through this challenge just changing directions completely and i ended up going for a more like cartoony turkey look which definitely worked out a lot better as you can see right here i am like I'm like questioning all of my life decisions that led me to this point that made me create this turkey dog. It was just like, I'm like, what have I done? And so I decided to go in and completely just just start over. I kept the little uh, little um, the beak and the little gobbler, but I started over, and this one turns out so much better. You will see in a moment. But you guys, with Thanksgiving over with, what was your favorite thing that you ate over Thanksgiving? My favorite thing has always been the uh, the sweet potato that have like the melted uh, marshmallows on them. I don't know why I absolutely love that, but please leave a comment on this video with the with your most favorite thing that you eat over Thanksgiving. And this turkey dog, you guys, this turkey dog is, it's, it's, it's almost done. It's almost done. I ended up just adding one last little detail that made this turkey dog look so much better. I was like, turkeys have wings. Let's try to make this dog look like it has wings. And so I decided to go in and kind of like paint like super cutesy kind of cartoony wings onto the front of the legs and like are onto the front legs. And you know what? I, I think that's kind of what brought it all together. It just looked so, so good. But we are almost out of time for this turkey dog, you guys. As you can see, it is very, very close to being done. The time is almost out. And very soon, we're going to get to go check out and see what Tiff ended up creating for her turkey dog. I am so excited. Here we go. Alrighty, the 10 minutes is up. Welcome back, everybody. I am so ready to look at which dog looks more like a turkey. <laughs> Ooh, does that mean you want to start with yours? <laughs> I mean, you know what? Like, you went for the realistic turkey. Like, look at the color blending though, like this very, I mean, you did a great job with like blending all the different colors together and like, you know, I mean. I, I, um, so I originally went in, like I was like, okay, I'm gonna make one of those really cool ones that kindergartners make, you know, like. Oh yeah, 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 the hand turkeys. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's exactly what I was going for. Wasn't even going for realism. And then I got really, really into the face and the head color. Then you did I a Googled, good job with it. Then I Googled turkeys, because I was making sure. And then I was yeah. like, oh, it's the whole head. I thought it was kind of like the, just the top half. And then I was like, no, the neck too. And I was like, okay, I'm getting into this. Spent most of my time doing that. Mm-hmm lost everything else and then I was like well I may as well go with the more realistic thing because I don't have time to think about what I want to do to make it into a cartoony thing now so then mm -hmm. I went to that and then I found a feather stencil which you don't see too much of because I just put it everywhere because turkeys have a lot of yeah. different color feathers I was just, this is I true know. this is true it's just a whole thing so it does look honestly like the color is like 10 out of 10 for matching a turkey <laughs> well, like thanks. you did a good job like matching like the color, like, yeah, when I look at this, I very much am like, it's a turkey. Cause it has like the whole blue, purpley, like head neck thing. Uh, and like the body color is like super accurate with all the different like kind of like, m like, you know, colors all blended together. I think actually, as far as like a realistic turkey, yours is really good. I, I mean, it's definitely a funky dog, but yeah. it's a, it's a okay turkey. <laughs> 
mean, yeah, I, I get it. It's just not what I was envisioning with no. Him, so that's why I don't Fair like enough. it. But yeah, it has a good realistic face. It does. Least. It does. Like I mean, the like I said, the blending of the color. Like there's so many different colors in there. You did a good job. No well, thanks. I feel okay. a little better about it. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> well, let's right, pop over to mine. Mine, great. Mine's name is Turkey is Gobble exactly, Gobble. Yours is, I love it. Um, Turkey yours Gobble. is exactly what I was going for, though. Like, <laughs> yeah. Well, I like the front legs were a last minute addition i had the tail i started off doing the little like little gobbler like down the side you know from yeah. the nose down and then i put the like the beak on it and then i was like now what and like okay and then i ended up like I, like I think i told you changing the breed halfway through i started with an australian shepherd and i was then like no i like i was gonna do like the like have like the feathers be all the tails but it just wasn't looking good like i was trying and trying and trying it was not looking good so then halfway through i'm like okay Switch of breed, I need a dog with a tail. Went with this one, painted the tail, and then I was like, now what? And then I decided to kind of try to make this like winged feather look on the front legs. And I was like, you know what? It's not terrible. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Oh, good, like, good. You you did what I wanted to do. Um. <laughs> <laughs> like more like the hand torquey type of thing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah that's, that's what I was going color, for. That's the color I was envisioning. Like you nailed exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> I know, but I like yours. This is such a, like, a beautiful, like, realistic looking turkey. Mine it's definitely perfect. looks like, mine looks like a hand turkey. Yeah, for yours sure. is hand turkey. Mine is realism. So it's like, <laughs> it's crazy cool. It's great. <laughs> uh, thank you. <laughs> But appearing on your screen is going to be an image as well as a poll in the upper right hand corner. Which turkey do you think, actually, which dog do you think looks more like a turkey? My my hand turkey or your very realistic dog turkey? <laughs> Click the card on the screen to watch more videos like this one. Be sure to subscribe and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.